people died again. Oh wait, you got some. The right. melting point of Somebody gold. Did die, but... The melting point of gold is one thousand nine hundred forty-eight degrees Fahrenheit. Yeah, so it's like a hot tub. It's, uh, still <laughs> wouldn't be able to be melted by jet fuel. So yeah, it wasn't an inside job. What? It was an was. inside job? I don't know. Whatever it was. There you go. So somebody died. Yeah. Um, he was a secret agent. I don't, I don't know if he did anything else other than that. But he did some TV. He was on a show called The Saint that they made a remake of the Val Kilmer in theaters. At what point <coughs> in Val Kilmer's career, though? Uh, this was, when he was uh, Fat Val Kilmer? No, was... this was before Fat Val Kilmer. This was like... I love the Val Kilmer pictures where he's just like eating and it's like, I'm Batman. <laughs> I think this was like close to like the heat Val Kilmer. Okay. Well, that was so, his like, peak. Yeah. He yeah. was a fantastically yeah. mediocre movie. <laughs> yeah, it was. Um, and who else was in heat? Uh, no, we're talking about heat now, Will. Okay. Fuck Roger. Or, or hey, fuck Roger. That's like he is Shay, one of Shay's favorite movies. I borrowed it from him, I believe, the one uh, oh, day. He, oh, I thought you said Roger Moore was one of his favorite movies. <laughs> yeah, I love Roger and Moore. And I can't remember because it has Shay's favorite actor in it. Uh, he was in Goodfellas as well. What, De Niro? Yeah. yeah. Shay, Shay fucking loves it. Oh, Niro. that's a little insight to Shay I didn't know about. Oh, I thought, yeah. the, I thought it was Pacino. Aren't they really interchangeable? <laughs> I mean, kind of. I mean, it took me years to figure out that they were different people. Thanks to Meet the Parents. It took me years to find out they actually weren't in a real <laughs> It was mob. both. It in was heat. Both. Yeah. Okay. In heat. Stop. They were both in heat. They were just scratching to get out. <laughs> but anyway, so that was our talk about heat. But Roger Moore Roger did Moore, die. yeah. yeah. James best. Bond. Yeah. Kind of. Not the one people remember. Hey, he's really. my third favorite, honestly. <laughs> he is. Who's your favorite? Uh, Connery. Yeah, Connery. I mean, everybody goes Connery. That, I that's love Connery. That's my mom's favorite. Yeah, because he was actually like, you saw Connery do Bond, and you're like, I think this is actually what he's really like in life. Like, he's just like, yeah. A sex I'm, fiend? <laughs> I'm smooth as hell. I've got a jetpack that would plausibly never work. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, I just bone chicks in pools and drink uh, improperly made martinis. That's, you know. Well, I know that one of our request topics is going to be about Bond, uh, so I'm not going to talk about that too much. But, oh, I uh, think I know who that yeah. one is. <laughs> but uh, Roger Moore was 89. Yes, he was. Which made me question, well, then how the... Too young. How too old soon. is fucking Connery? So I had to look it up. He's 86. Too soon. Uh, you tried to do a Connery when you said 86 yeah, a little bit. He's 86. He's 86 years old this year. How do you do a Roger Moore? I don't know. Did he even have like, like? I mean, he was just British guy. Like yeah. I, I don't know. He's like, I'm Roger Moore. So he's like, I, don't I know, fucking don't. <laughs> what fucking is this? <laughs> Neither of these are British. I can't do much better. So Roger Moore. I fucking died. <laughs> I, dr I drank vodka and I died. That's how it happened. Um, is he here? You're about, yeah. you're about yeah. to get that uh, that Matt hate. Normally, he's the one that's real. Yeah, get, cynical about get the ready. dead guy. You'll start looking like this. Well, I didn't shed a tear over Roger Moore. Like like Matt said, he's like... See, I actually did. I crashed my car, bought a new one. <laughs> then I cried in that one. He ruined it. The, the appreciation now. I came home and I pulled out all my Bond laser discs of Roger Moore and I wept on them. First of all, the man with the golden gun is really good. It's only good because... Let's, uh... It's only good it's because really... mini Me's in it and, uh... <laughs> Uh, Christopher, Christopher Lee. Lee yeah. Christopher Lee does the. Do I was like really questioning, is that the one that Christopher Lee was in? Yeah. Yeah. And then wasn't uh, wasn't the Jaws guy in that one? Jaws was not in that one. Sure. Jaws was in uh, Moonraker. Yeah. I thought he was in yeah. more than one though. Because they were like, I we think gotta he, get I think that he freak back. He got stuck in space. Yeah, it's true. Yeah. With Jason. <laughs> <laughs> they duked it out and he um, won. Who? Jaws. I mean, obviously. Oh, well, yeah. I mean, he bit that and shit yeah, bite in half. Just right. because Jason has a metal mass doesn't mean them teeth can't get through it. He can bite through anything. So, anyway, man. Roger He'll Moore. Bite through. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, what can be said? Um, well, I mean, we already did say everything. I honestly like, can't say I know too much about the like, man. He was in his 80s. He died. Really and mm -hmm. he was in good Ro Bond films. Mm -hmm. And he's my third favorite. Mm -hmm. Who's your second? Uh, Daniel Craig. Daniel Craig is very good. Okay. He's fantastic. Okay. Especially in this in uh, Skyfall, when he, they basically just pity him and let him continue being an agent, even though he's like, <laughs> I can't shoot straight to save my fucking life. And they're like, it's all right, you're Bond. Here you go. Here's your here's your car and your gun. He gets a pass. Uh -huh. 
it's pretty much what happened. He failed the entire exam. They're just like, you know, well, you know, we need a movie, so yeah. Go ahead. They, they they pitied him to uh, here's your badge, the, the hero role. I was going to put in like Spectre. I enjoyed Spectre. Uh, I think it's just because Spectre came after the gigantic success that was Skyfall. Everybody expected another Skyfall, and it was something different. Yeah. So that's I, did, I will say I didn't like the opening. To Spectre, that song was not. I didn't good. really care for the villain in Spectre. Oh wait, no, the villain in Skyfall was fucking terrible. The no, guy, Skyfall was Mr. Just Touchy the, Feely. Yeah. It was Spectre just like was okay. Spectre was the. I wasn't, can't it, wasn't it uh, the guy from Star Trek with the Wessels? I can't it? remember. <laughs> I can never remember his name, but he played uh, <clears throat> the bounty hunter in Django and Chain. He played the Nazi in Inglorious Bastards. The one that like. Great repertoire. That like. Betrayed, and it's like, yeah, this is what's gonna happen. I'm gonna let you guys live, but I want to be set up in America with all these things that I want. And then Brad Pitt carves a swastika in his forehead. I mean, he touch that up. <laughs> <laughs> you just, but you some, just fillet that part off and then just let it grow back. I mean, you'll look weird, but at least there won't be a swastika in your head. And what happens you, when people ask, what's the scar in your forehead? Yeah, I don't know. If, uh, if everybody goes to our Patreon that I didn't set up yet and donates money, I'll carve a swastika sticker in my forehead. <laughs> That's going to be the first, like, bonus feature for Patreon. Yeah, if we hit the uh, $500, nah, $5 level, I'll carve a <laughs> swastika sticker in my forehead. Jesus Christ. These are fucking checks that your fucking forehead is not going to want to cash. If, um, if we hit 500 I will cry over a picture of Roger Moore while driving my car off a cliff. <laughs> <laughs> You know, like, the thing is, is, like, once you cry in your car, like, the value drops. So, like, you drive it off a lot, it, it drops, it and then you cry it, it and it really drops. depends. There are people that love to revel in sorrow, so <laughs> they will buy cars that have been pre-cried in. Oh, but that yeah. also depends on what you cried over. Yeah. And well, how I mean, much actual sorrow you felt. A picture of Roger Moore, that, that's pretty high up there. That's a lot of sadness. I guess. If you leave the tear-stained photo in the car, too. Yes! That, that's extra. Yeah. yeah. That's inside of a, uh, a safety box, like a black box, so that when... Oh, yeah, I'll definitely put it inside of something fireproof, like an oven or something. <laughs> Saved Indy. I'll just have a oven in my Sorry, trunk. Sorry, that was a refrigerator. Yeah. It was. Yeah, it was a kitchen. That's where you put stuff if you want to keep them cold. Fireproof's an oven. If I... Actually, if I didn't have a wife, I probably would keep all my important papers in the oven, so I'd never cook. So, <laughs> the house burns down, it's basically a fireproof safe, yeah. so. Well, rest in peace, Roger Moore. <laughs> <laughs> wow.